Taking a look at today's interest rate markets, let's look at the two-year note futures as they're realizing some selling pressure for a third session. We are seeing the two-year note futures now trading down to the lowest level since the middle of June. And looking at the December future, which is now the most actively traded future, we're looking at a price level of 104 04 spot six, which is off the intraday lows of 104.02 spot five, but nonetheless still lower on the session. I think when you look at some of the driving factors today, number one, data points this morning, consumer confidence stronger than anticipated. Uh, and I think that that had an influence across the different uh, durations today. We did see selling pressure across all the durations. However, the, as we move through the session, the back end of the curve was able to bounce off of those lows and actually on the back end of the curve trade higher on the session front end of the curve not so much we continue to remain uh down on the session and looking at the other impact i think today was the fed message continuing to be very hawkish and when you have uh, strong consumer confidence numbers or at least better than expected coming in with uh unemployment in in data leading up to the unemployment report this friday which is also showing signs of strength uh, that um, I think that that's why we're seeing this selling pressure remain in the short end of the curve. Now, looking at the yields today, we're looking at a two-year yield of 347 basis points, which is up four basis points on the session. Now, we did see the last couple of days it push up almost to 349 basis points intraday, which corresponds with the highest level, the highest yield for the two-year in almost 15 years. You have to go back to the end of 2007 to see the two-year yield at these levels. And also when you look at the yield curve today, as I mentioned, the back end of the curve is actually able to rally somewhat today later in the session. So we did see selling pressure on the front of the curve, pushing those yields higher. Uh, the ones, the th twos, the threes, and the fives were so sold off today a little bit. Uh, middle of the curve uh, to the back end of the curve, the tens, the twenties, and the thirties were either flat to up slightly on the session. So therefore we did see further inversion in the yield curve in today's price action.